So today's question is, what is it like living in Laos? This question has many different parts. So we're gonna break this question down. First, we're gonna be looking at what is life like living in Laos as a foreigner by covering the Laos locals, internet in Laos, and also earning money in Laos as a foreigner. Next, we'll be exploring how much money do you need to retire in Laos today? Followed by what you need to know if you're planning to live in Laos full time. And lastly, which is perhaps one of the biggest questions, is should you live in Laos? So first of all, let's look at living in Laos as a foreigner. And one of the most important factors is the local people. Laos locals are extremely friendly and they are often very welcoming to foreign visitors. In Laos, showing shared respect and courtesy for the individual and their traditions will always get you very far when living in this area as a foreigner. Additionally, some parts of Laos are not very touristy, so you may be looked at a little bit more often than normal, but this is not due to disrespect, it's often just out of curiosity. The next important factor, especially for digital nomads and those people who are working online, is the internet in Laos. Even in this modern world, the internet in Laos is not the best. You will still be able to do many of the tasks, but it may take you much longer than average, and video performance may be be slightly lower. Nonetheless, several expats who are living and working in Laos full-time get by just fine. It really depends on your geographical location, the type of connection, and of course, the provider. Another popular topic is earning money. Can you earn money in Laos as a foreigner? Well, let's address the requirements. And the first requirement is, of course, the correct visa. To start a business, you will need to have the appropriate business visa, although the requirements are not too complex and the process is relatively straightforward. But aside from starting up your own business, you also have the option to offer your services as an English teacher, which is still a very highly demand service in Laos. There are also many volunteer opportunities for those who are looking to get involved without the financial gain. The next category we move on to is retirement, and specifically, how much money do you need to retire in Laos today? The total cost can range anywhere between $800 at the bare minimum to $1,500. If you are looking to enjoy your retirement fully, let's say, then you may wish to budget on the higher end of that scale. Nonetheless, it is possible to live and retire in Laos for much less. I recently published a full article about retirement in Laos, so I'll make sure that I add a link in the description below for those of you who are looking for more information. What I would add is, as a good rule of thumb, it's always recommended to budget slightly higher than you expect to spend, as this will cover any retirement or living expenses that you may occur during your retirement. The next important topic is what do you need to know about living in Laos as a foreigner? Well, there are several laws. The first law really applies to a lot of singletons out there, as the Laos government prohibits sexual relationships between foreigners and Laos citizens. The only time this is legal is when they are married in accordance to Lao family law. Some scams have been reported of police and adult workers working together to scam travelers and fine them, as the fine for being caught is $500, and I believe this is the minimum amount. However, these reports have not been verified though many independent statements exist. Additionally, getting involved in any kind of drugs is strictly prohibited and carries with it a very severe punishment, including the death penalty. Aside from these, there are also some less well-known restrictions, including photographing certain buildings, such as military sites. So with all this in mind, should you live in Laos? Living in Laos as a foreigner, whether you are retired or not, offers some unique benefits, including some common pros and cons similar to every Southeast Asian country. Laos is not the cheapest country, however, and thus it may be better for retirees or expats who are looking to live in Southeast Asia on a budget to consider other countries such as Thailand, Vietnam, etc. Nonetheless, the locals are extremely friendly, the food is fantastic, and the scenery is beautiful. Thank you.